Today, more Palm Beach residents may be evacuating as they continue watching the track of Hurricane Dorian. Officials closing down several beach towns and parks and opening up shelters this weekend. Our team coverage continues with CBS 4's Peter Dench. He's live from Boynton Beach. Peter, good morning. Well, good morning in Boynton Beach here. We are 60 miles north of Miami, just south of West Palm Beach. We're under a tropical storm warning and a hurricane watch here, and there are mandatory evacuations for building structures here in zones A and B. Taking a look at some video right here, low-lying areas include the Briny Breezes Mobile Homes Park in Boynton Beach, other low-lying areas affected as well. Zone B includes barrier islands and other low-lying areas. Now, we've seen how some businesses have signs on them saying they're closed. Sandbags are out as well, and we can tell you the residents are very concerned. You know, we're down here seven months a year. If we lose the home and, and what belongings we still have in there, we're starting all over, but we're not... We're going to make sure we're safe. It's hard to leave your home, you know, and you got to just trust that God will protect it. Now, shelters were open as of 1 p.m. yesterday. We tried to get closer to the beach when we hit the bridge here in Boynton Beach. We were turned away by police, or only allowing residents right next to the ocean. So in the meantime, we are live here by a dock where it's just started to rain. We expect uh, more rain to come down this morning. In the meantime, we're live in Boynton Beach. Peter Danch, CBS 4 News.